So that's what historical preservation is. It's life, and it's a crucial part of our existence. Welcome to Miami Preserves, the podcast where we explore historic places in Miami and what it means to preserve our history. I'm your host, Lucia Meneses. I'm also the school programs manager at Dade Heritage Trust, a nonprofit organization established in 1972 with a mission to preserve Miami-Dade County's architectural, environmental, and cultural heritage through education, advocacy, and preservation. In this podcast, we're going to focus on Miami history and preservation through the lens of African-American historic sites. We'll hear from scholars and historians with firsthand experience and knowledge of what it was like during the era of segregation in Miami. I go to the post office, we're in line, and these white people kept getting in front of my mother. I asked her, why do those people keep getting in front of us? And she said, because we're colored. That's the first time I realized being colored meant you had to be behind somebody else. I was six years old and what these historians and scholars make of the current political landscape in Florida. They want to spare their children from knowing the history of what white people have done to black people. And it needs to be told. The full story needs to be told. And somebody needs to tell Governor DeSantis that. You'll also hear from teachers and students and how they are navigating some of the changes in education happening in Florida specifically things like censorship and expansion of parental rights. As for violating the Stop Woke Act, so woke means to be educated. So I'm not sure why you wouldn't want to be educated on something. It makes me feel sad that these laws are probably not going to get repealed for a while and that there's going to be a group of kids that are going to not learn that dark part of history. In the end, we'll try to make sense of preservation and what it looks like in a city that is so development-oriented like Miami. For me, preservation is really about education and helping people learn about where they live. Buildings don't lie. Be sure to tune in to Miami Preserves wherever you listen to podcasts.